The ancient civilization of Egypt has always been shrouded in mystery. From its religious practices to its long forgotten language, the Egyptian culture has more than enough buried secrets to keep both archaeologists and Egyptologists busy in the pursuit of the truth for many generations to come. So though there may be countless mysterious and even more soon to be uncovered, we have gone through and selected the most mind-boggling discoveries that keep even the most gifted researchers scratching their head in wonder. Here are five mysteries of ancient Egypt. The Great Pyramids of Giza Definitely one of the most puzzling mysteries on the planet, the Great Pyramids of Giza have been classified as one of the seven wonders of the world. The sheer size, precision and manpower required to build such a colossal structure is nearly impossible, even in the modern era. Which makes it all the more mysterious that an ancient culture such as one of the first civilizations ever to arise had the engineering capacity and means to create the massive pyramids of Giza. For a reference to the size of the pyramids, each block of the colossal structure weighs roughly 2.5 metric tons with over 2.3 million blocks making up the entirety of the structure. Not only did this require 315 blocks to be moved in place each day for the next 20 years, but to accomplish such a building scale of delivering the large stones and moving them into place even today would be an impossible feat unable to be matched. If a stone wall was made to be 2 feet high and 4 inches wide, using the blocks of the pyramid at Giza, the wall would wrap around the circumference of the entire world. Not only this, but the blocks were made with such perfect precision that each block appears to be an exact clone in size to the rest of the blocks of the pyramid, meaning the cut of each stone was so perfect it would be impossible to slide something as thin as a piece of paper between any two stones. The only way to accomplish such a precision cut in the modern era would be to rely on laser guiding and cutting. As new discoveries and 3D mapping of the pyramids continued, even more mysterious natures of their structure were found. Archaeologists and Egyptologists found high trace amounts of chemical compounds throughout the shafts of the pyramids that have the ability to have generated a massive amount of hydrogen by utilising commonly found base chemicals in the region leading some conspiracy theorists to believe that the pyramids themselves could have once been powerful hydrogen generators capable of supplying electricity and energy similar to modern-day power plants. Considering no other explanations for the trace chemicals have been posited forward with any success, it appears to be the only standing theory relative to explaining any purpose the pyramids had considering not a single body or artifact had been found inside the structures including chambers never previously opened inside the colossal structures. Whatever theory you subscribe to, the nature of the pyramids are not just a mystery of Egypt, but a mystery of the history of humanity. Uncovered cities buried in sand In ancient Egyptian documents, there had been reference to a city called Thonis that had the capability of being an international trading hub with the capacity to send imports and exports from around the world. As archaeologists and Egyptologists raced to uncover this city and its location given the instructions and references made by the many recovered Egyptian documents, they stumbled across a mystery that would go on to baffle them for decades. The city simply did not exist anywhere. Many historians merely viewed the site as a potential myth in the hopes of creating Egyptian propaganda given the idea that the ancient civilization could not have possibly possessed the ability to set up international trade routes or a hub of the magnitude and size reported by the ancient Egyptian documents. However, this theory had been proven wrong given recent discoveries. After ancient Greek accounts detailing a city referred to as Heracleion gave instructions and evidence of an international Egyptian trading hub in the region described similarly to that of the ancient Egyptian documents. Archaeologists began their search once more for the fabled port, but this time they found it. Somehow, the city had been completely sunken deep into the bay, with the mud and sand of the region completely preserving every facet of the city from beautifully recovered artifacts, massive trade ships, 
and many other interesting religious temples that led many researchers to believe that not only was the city a hub for trade and religious services, but could have been a hub with the ability to send imports and exports internationally as the ancient accounts described. This discovery only led to further questions, however. How did the city sink? Why is everything perfectly preserved? And how fast did this catastrophe occur for everything to nearly be flash frozen in time? Not only this, but how were ancient civilizations capable of having developed such trading hubs thousands of years before the perceived advancements of the future ages to come? An ancient Egyptian zoo. Animals were perhaps the most loved and revered beings by the ancient Egyptian culture due to their belief that the gods would often manifest themselves in the form of the natural world and animal personas. This led to significant advancements in the realm of the anatomy of animals and their study, including recovered evidence of highly sensitive surgeries performed on animals to prolong their life and fix ailments or injuries. What seemed to take many archaeologists and Egyptologists by surprise, however, was the wide availability and reference to animals made by the ancient Egyptians. Dubbed as the world's first zoo, a 6,000-year-old ancient Egyptian cemetery was uncovered filled with the remains of wild animals from around the world that should have been out of the reaches of early man for thousands of years to come. Skeletons of ostriches, crocodiles, leopards and other exotic animals were found alongside pools of water, large fenced-in cages and a potential animal hospital filled with removed molars, teeth, claws and evidence of animal surgeries. Though the importance of animals regarding the Egyptian religion was widely known, the evidence of the global reach of the species available to them, including species long believed to be extinct, has been a mystery that even the most elite of archaeologists and Egyptologists have failed to explain. The Accounts of the Sea People Though there were many ancient civilizations that had existed during the 12th century BC, Suddenly and quite unexpectedly, nearly every civilization was wiped out from the face of the earth except the cities of Egypt. This phenomenon was recorded as the Late Bronze Age collapse that soon bled into the early Greek Dark Ages as only small villages of humanity survived this sudden catastrophe. For many decades, the cause of such an occurrence had widely been unknown and shrouded in mystery. That was until the ancient language of the Egyptian hieroglyphics had been decoded and allowed us to read the historical records captured at the time by the last standing ancient civilization. This record has led to countless theories and endless debate amongst Egyptologists, classic historians and archaeologists since its findings. Reportedly, by the historical accounts of the ancient Egyptians, armies of what had been referred to at the time as Sea People attacked and demolished the cities of man. In fact, the descriptions of the armies of the Sea People describe monsters and giants coming from the oceans and waging war against all of civilization. The reasoning for why this sudden onslaught had occurred has yet to be better understood. But what is all the more surprising is the vast conspiracy surrounding the events. Accounts continue of the Egyptians attempting to track the source of the beasts that appeared humanoid in nature and found hundreds of footprints leaving and coming from the beaches of the Mediterranean Sea. Today, after uncovering vast art depicting the battles, documents detailing the events and further evidence of war and tactics used against the destroyed and forgotten civilizations of the past, the proof of the account of the Sea People appears to be overwhelming in nature. As a matter of fact, the events are so overwhelming that the discussion surrounding the event in the scientific community has been completely shut down and further theories or attempts at uncovering the truth are treated with both disdain and ridicule. Regardless of this ridicule, however, many researchers continue to attempt to understand the mysteries of the Sea People and remain restless in their pursuits. Perhaps one day we will better understand whether these accounts are of mythology or true history. Until then, the accounts of the Sea People are shrouded in creepy events and terrifying mysteries. The Hatshepsut Problem Many of those among the Jewish community were outraged when countless Egyptologists and archaeologists came forward in a possibly politically motivated move to discredit the Jewish scriptures by claiming that evidence of the Jewish people 
having once existed in Egypt and enslaved by the pharaohs of the past to be completely fraudulent and that there was no record in the historical text of the Jewish people ever having existed within the ancient culture at any period of time. Though many argued that it was possible that the history could very easily have been written by pharaohs and artifacts of the events could have been destroyed to cover up this shame, many archaeologists stood steadfast in their belief that the ancient Egyptian culture would have never destroyed artifacts or historical evidence given their incredible reverence of timekeeping, religious protection and historical importance. This argument was immediately thrown out the window after the discovery of Hatshepsut. Hatshepsut was the first female pharaoh of the ancient Egyptian culture and was seen as such a hated figure given her female status that after her reign she was nearly completely wiped from the historical record if it were not for a few hidden and surviving obelisks detailing her reign and stature. This discovery has placed a huge mystery over the heads of the historical record now believing it to be not as nearly credible as once before and possibly purposefully misleading and fraught with cover-ups and ancient conspiracies. But what do you think about these Egyptian mysteries? Be sure to leave your questions and answers below and help us grow this community and work to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.